Hey, hey, y'all. Welcome back. Welcome back. So will you believe it? I am inside of CVS, y'all. And I think I'm actually going to do a, a haul. Or if I don't, I'm still going to show you some amazing ways that you can maximize your savings and not pay full price on things you're probably going to pay for anyway. So we have tons of deals this week at CVS from oil care, household essentials. So definitely like the video and subscribe. But let's jump into the video. All right, y'all. So the first deal I want to mention, and like I always say, y'all, cater the deal to your need. But if you're in need of toothpaste, we have um, this deal right here on the Crest. It's on a promotion where if you spend $10, and it includes other items, so you don't just have to get toothpaste. Um, but if you spend $10, you get back a $5 extra buck. And as you see, some of these are as cheap as $3.89. And if your store honors the 98% rule, you could pick up two of these at $4.99. And with that 98% rule, as long as you're within 98% of the required threshold, so in this case, it's $10. So as long as you're within 98% of that, you'll still get like the extra buck. So you could grab some of the cheaper toothpaste and then maybe some of the more expensive items. And then maybe you need toothbrushes. You can grab maybe a toothbrush and then um, a toothpaste. I know we have $2 digitals for the toothpaste and we have a $2 digital for the toothbrush. And on top of that, on Abata, I know I always talk about Abata. It's a free cashback app. So it's another way that you can maximize your savings even more. But we do have some offers um, for the Oral-B toothbrush giving back $2. So another great way that you can maximize your savings. So I think I may or may not do this deal. We'll see. Um, and look, some of these toothbrushes are as cheap as $4.39. Uh, $4 so you could really get close to that $10 mark. And then with this deal, you can do it a limit of two. So like if you wanted to get $20 worth of products, maybe you have a threshold. I know on one of my accounts, I have a threshold CRT. And like I always say, a CRT is another word for, C for um, CVS coupon. And um, I have one where if I spend $18 worth, I'll save $3. And you can combine CRTs with manufacturer coupons. So those digital coupons that I mentioned. So we'll see. Um, I may just show you how you could do the deal. But I may or may not do this deal and add it into like my... Um, a threshold uh crt we'll see and then look even these crest kids toothpaste are included and they're 329 so maybe you're creating like a baby shower maybe you have kids that need toothbrushes so it's tons of ways you can switch your deal around all right y'all so the next deal i'm really excited about which is really what made me kind of come out to the store today and i'm glad that they have what i need so this week select like Cotton nail, Viva paper towels. They're on a promotion where if you spend twenty dollars worth, you're gonna get back a five dollar extra buck. So there's several ways you can do the deal. You can get two of the tissues. It includes this purple pack, this blue bag, uh, blue pack, or you can get the Viva right here, the six equals nine, which is also ten forty nine. Now we don't have any digital coupons. Now how I'm gonna do the deal is actually get one of each because like I tell y'all from time to time I do sell things in my stockpile and. <laughs> One of the people I sell to, they really like the Viva. I like the Viva paper towels too. And they like cotton nail. So I'm going to go ahead and grab one of each. And this is a great scenario to show you because I am going to have like an out of pocket. But then I'm thinking about the money I'm going to be making back. So I'm okay with it. But like I always say, think about things you're going to pay for anyway. If you know you need tissue and maybe um, you're just trying to like try out how to coupon at CVS. This would be a great week to start, especially if you need oral care and things like that as well. So I'm going to grab one tissue and then one of the paper towels, and then um, I'll show you the breakdown. So picking up two, whichever way you decide to do it, will total you $20.98. So you would end up, of course, paying it at the register, and then you'll get back the $5 extra buck. And remember, extra buck is another word for CVS cash, so you could turn around and use that to buy something in the store. Um, so that'll end up dropping you down to $15.98 or just $7.99 a pack. Now, remember, if you have any threshold CRTs, like on one of my accounts, I have a six off of 30. You might want to add in like maybe the Crest deal or maybe some other deals that I'll show you. But there's several ways that you can, of course, have a lower out of pocket. But if you just came in here, grab two, that's how you would do the deal. So an amazing time to get stuck. And those of you who may be in need of maybe like other household essentials, we 
normally always have this deal on like PG products and household beverages and like personal care products. Where if you spend thirty dollars worth, you get back a ten dollar extra buck. So if you need laundry care, I like incorporating these type of deals together because a lot of times we get tons of different digitals. Like I know for the Tide, I believe we have a three dollar digital, so you could like pick up some of the larger ones at twelve ninety nine. Um, maybe you want some of the smaller products that are included, like the Gain Flings or the Tide Pods, or even like the Gain Liquid Detergents. They're five forty nine. We have Dollar Digitals, so tons of ways you can do the deal. You can even grab like the beads if maybe you prefer the beads. So always cater it to your need. So many different options. Just make sure you're scanning your items on your CVS app so you can confirm that your digital coupons or CRTs are attaching. And then if you're one that maybe wants to get stocked up on like hair wigs, Lysol, other household items, there is another promotion where if you spend $15 worth on Lysol, Wool Light, or any, any hair wig, you get back a $3 extra buck. So I know we, I believe, still have digitals for like Lysol. I know on the Abata app, I have like an offer for like $5 back on the air wig. It says it includes like the five count, but... Yeah, tons of ways you can do your deal. And then remember with the PG deal, you spend 30, get 10 back. You don't just have to get laundry care. It normally includes several other items. And how I like to know what's included on the actual, like if you use like your desktop computer, um, you can actually go to like CVS.com and then on the, you can go to like the actual weekly ad. And then what you see where it says like spend 30, get 10, you can click on one of those items and then it'll show you like the items that are like participating in that uh, promotion. So that's how I like to do it. Or you can actually go to an item that you know is a part of the deal. And then when you scroll up, um, it'll say, uh, you know, spend 30, get 10, view products that are qualifying. You can click that and it'll show you the list of things as well. So another way that you can see like what items are participating in certain deals. Another item which I'm actually excited about because i think i am going to do the spend 30 dollars deal only because i need to get stocked up on some of the body wash and we do have like an activate rewards deal going on which i'll mention so as you see here i was able to print off some two dollar paper coupons from the avino website so you got to be a new um customer so of course if maybe you don't have one under your spouse or your kids or your friend you might want to create an account um but you can print two of those two dollar paper coupons and then you may still also have your three off of two digital and if you've been following me then you know from time to time sometimes those digital coupons may double dip with the paper coupons so if you spend thirty dollars worth, you'll get back a ten dollar extra buck. But again, you don't just have to get Aveeno. Maybe you can get some laundry care, mix and match. But I think I'm gonna focus on the Aveeno spending thirty dollars worth because I saw where we had a activate rewards program. I'll put the link down below. But it's several ways you can do the deal. You don't just have to get Aveeno. It includes like other items too. But if you um, spend, I think it's twenty, you get five dollar like gift card, or you spend thirty, get a ten dollar um activate rewards like visa gift card and i've done this before and you know they're really quick about it so i think i might just do this deal so let me show you how i plan on doing my deal all right y'all so for my uh spend 30 dollars deal get back a 10 dollar extra buck promotion this is how i plan on doing it again cater it to your need you don't have to get a vino you can get several other items but i picked up the big thing of a vino body wash it's 11.99 and I have a two off of 12 of, you know, like body um, CRT. Now my store honors a 98% rule, so I'll still get that $2 off. And then I picked up this Avino lotion, which is $8.29. And I'm going to use a three off of 10 cosmetic nail hair uh, CRT. Now I'm only $8.29 towards that $10 balance, but that's why i picked up this avino face cream which is 13.49 because i have a two off of 10 like avino facial crt that's attaching so because i just need to spend ten dollars for that crt but this is 13 
um, 49, at least $3.49 will help me reach that threshold for that three off of 10 um, cosmetic nail CRT. So I hope that didn't confuse you. Um, and then on top of that, I have a three off of two manufacturer digital that attaches to the body wash and the lotion. And remember from time to time, those sometimes do double dip with the paper coupon. Now that three off of two digital does not work for like the facial products I noticed, but I'm gonna use the $2 paper coupon on the lotion because I'm thinking that we may get a double dip. Three off of two should double dip with the $2 paper coupon. So everything right here, y'all, totals me. $33.77. So that also qualifies me to get back that $10 Activ Activate Rewards Visa gift card. And I like to use those on like, you know, items that I may not coupon for, food, you know, it's tr you treat it like a Visa gift card. So this is $33.77. But after those CRTs that I mentioned come off and then the three off of two digital and my $2 paper coupon, if it does double dip and come off, at the register, y'all, I should pay $21.77. So like I always say, if you have extra bucks, you use that to lower your out of pocket. I think on this account, I have like $13 in extra bucks. But if you didn't have extra bucks, of course you would pay the $21.77 out of pocket. But then remember, we would get back the $10 extra buck for spending 30. We would get back the $10 for the activate rewards. And we would get back $2 from Abata for the body wash, $1.50 for the lotion, and a dollar seventy five for the facial cream. So, like I always say, if you're new to Abada, it's a free cashback app. And on top of that, if you use my referral code, which you'll see here on the screen, you'll actually get ten dollars after submitting your first receipt and offer. And we have offers on each one of these items. And then I have a bonus where if I complete like two offers, I think on body care and personal cleansing, I get back an additional dollar. So I'll be getting back six dollars and twenty five cents in cash from Abada. So that's gonna then make all all this y'all not only free but a four dollar and 48 cent money maker now i want to show you how much it's actually going to be for me since i'm going to be using 13 dollars in extra bucks so for me i'm going to be using extra bucks to lower my out of pocket so this is like if you're more so focused on like your actual cash out of pocket that you're spending so for me that's how i'm going to look at it so again this is 33.77 it's going to, after my CRTs and coupons come off at the register, that would be $21.77. But I'm going to use those $13 in extra bucks that I have, which will then drop me down to paying $8.77 at the register. So like I always say, if you have like the Fetch Rewards app, redeem for a CVS gift card because then you could use that to lower your out-of-pocket even more. Now I have one, but I don't think I have like $10 worth, um, a $10 gift card. But you could always use that to lower your out-of-pocket as well but let's say i didn't have that i would pay 877 at the register but then remember i'm going to submit my receipt to abata for the six dollars and 25 cents in cash back which is then going to make this just two dollars and 52 cents for me but remember i'm getting back that ten dollar visa card now you can kind of i kind of am kind of looking at that as cash since i can use that on other items so once i get back that ten dollar activity activate rewards that's going to make this a seven dollar and 48 cent money maker for me y'all now remember i am getting back the ten dollar extra buck as well but how i look at that is i started off with 13 but now i got 10 so again y'all comment below though how y'all kind of do your deals i like to look at it like how much is like my bank account going down how much cash am i actually spending um but you may look at it differently so tons of ways that you can look at it I'm glad that I'm going to be getting stocked up on some of these items that I really need in my stockpile. Another deal that I may or may not do, we'll see. But the Neutrogena, like select ones on a promotion, like you buy two, get a $4 extra buck, or buy three, get a $7 extra buck. And these little, like, bars um, are normally included. So you could pick up three. They're $2.99 each. So that'll total you $8.97. And then you would get back a $7 extra buck, making it $1.97 for three. Now, remember, if you have extra bucks, always use your extra bucks to lower your out of pocket. But another great option, especially if you're using like a threshold coupon or maybe you have some extra bucks expiring that you don't want to waste completely. So a great time to get stocked up on some Neutrogena. And I also believe Neutrogena might be a part of the Activate Rewards um, participating products as well. So again, just click the link down in the description box so you can see what participating items are included because you don't just have to get like a Vino.
So y'all, I think I'm gonna change the Aveeno deal just a little bit because I actually have a cheaper out of pocket because I noticed that with the facial product, this one right here at $13.49, remember I have that two off of 12 CRT and then I also plan on using that three off of 10 uh, cosmetic CRT that I'm combining with the lotion. But I realize I'm not using any like manufacturer coupons, just that two off of 10 threshold coupon. So I think what I might do is just get a cheaper lotion instead and then use that other $2 paper coupon that I have. Since regardless, I'm getting $2 off of this $13.49 product, but it's not attaching to like that digital or those paper coupons that I have. But I could just pick up a lotion that's cheaper and use the $2 paper coupon and then I'll get back a dollar fifty another dollar fifty from a bottle for this versus a dollar seventy five for this um but i mean it's still gonna come out cheaper because instead of like what 33 and some change that my total was with this it'll end up being thirty dollars and like 22 cents with this so let me show you the new break now all right y'all so here's how i plan on doing my vino deal so i picked up two of the lotions i picked up one at 9.99 and then one at 8.29 and then I picked up the body wash at $11.99. So for one of the body washes, I mean, for the lotion, I'm going to use a three off of 10 for the one for $9.99. And then for the body wash at $11.99, I'm going to use that two off of 12 CRT. And then remember, I have that six off of two digital that attaches to these. And then I'm going to use two of the paper coupons, which should double dip and come off. So what that'll leave me paying at the register after both of the $2 paper coupons come off, the three off of two digital double dips with that, and then the CRTs, the three off of 10 CRT and the two off of 12 CRT comes off, I should pay $18.27 at the register. But remember, I'm gonna submit my receipt to Abada to get back $1.50 twice because I got two of the lotions and then $2 for the body wash. And then remember I have that bonus, well, I'll get back a dollar for buying two. So I should get back $6 from Abata, dropping this down to $12.27. And then remember, I'm getting back that $10 Activate Rewards for spending $30 worth, which is then going to drop this down to just $2.27. But then remember, we spent $30 worth. It's a part of the promotion. Spend 30 get 10 So I'll get back that $10 extra buck, making this not only free, but a $7.73 money maker, y'all. Now, for me, though, it's going to total me $30.27 still, but I'm going to be using $13 in extra bucks to lower my out-of-pocket. So at the register, I'm going to pay $5.27, and then I'm going to submit my receipt to Abada for the $6 in cash, then making this not only free, but a $0.73 moneymaker. And then I'm going to get back the $10 Activate Rewards Visa gift card, which then makes this which is then going to make this not only free, but a $9 and like 37 cent money maker. But then remember, I'm getting back the $10 extra buck if you want to count that, making this a $19 and like 37 cent money maker, y'all. So I'd rather get lotion anyway than the facial products. So I came out much cheaper. So a great way that you can switch your deal around based off of your need. All right, y'all went ahead and checked out doing the Aveeno deal first. And I want to show you the receipt. So there is the lotion at $8.29, and then there is the other lotion at $9.99. Oh, when did it ring up for $10.49? And then there's the body wash at $11.99, and then there's all of the coupons. I think the lotion, y'all, was a little bit higher, like 50 cents higher. Um, and then there's all the coupons. Both of the $2 paper coupons scanned successfully. The three off of two did double dip. The 3 off of 10 cosmetic CRT came off. The 2 off of 12 of, you know, body wash CRT came off. And then I used $13 in extra bucks and then like 73 cents um, uh, in extra bucks, leaving me to pay $504 before tax. And then, y'all, I, uh, I did place that on a Fetch Rewards gift card, which I had like $4.95. So it left me to actually pay like $1.45 out of pocket. Then I submitted my receipt to Abada. Now, I will say when I submitted to Abada, it didn't pick up the body wash. It made it seem like it was a lotion. So I just scanned the body wash and then it gave me the $2 offer for the body wash and then $1.50 for each of the lotions. And I got back that bonus for buying two. So I got back $6 in cash from Abada and I got back the $10 extra buck, y'all, for spending $30. And then I just submitted my receipt to the Activate Rewards um, so that way I can get $10 for spending $30 on the Aveeno, y'all. 
So for me, so for me, I paid out a dollar forty-five because remember, my subtotal was five oh four, but plus tax it was six forty, which I put on the Fetch Rewards gift card, which didn't cost me anything, and it left me to pay one forty-five. And then I submitted my receipt to a body, got back six dollars in cash, making this not only free but like a four dollar and some change money maker. And if you want to include the ten dollar extra buck I got back, made this a fourteen dollar money maker now for you um you would pay the 18 actually the the 9.99 lotion did ring up for 10.49 so my out of pocket was actually like 50 cents more but you would pay the 18.77 out of pocket submit your receipt to abata for six dollars dropping it down to just uh 12.77 and then you would get back the ten dollar extra buck making it just 277 for all of those items and then remember you'll be getting back the ten dollar activate reward so then it'll end up make, making this like a seven dollar something money maker so still not bad especially if these are something you're going to pay for anyway and this next deal i was really excited about because if y'all know me i love to get stocked up on food items now oh yeah they do mm, i think the yeah they do have them so there's two different deals going on that i'm actually going to uh take part in so the general meal cereals like select ones are $1.99 so you get like the cocoa puff cinnamon toast crunch and then on top of that check your digital coupons because i actually have two of those one off of two digitals and a lot of times those also double dip and come off together so you could pick up two again they're $1.99 each use that uh use two of the one off of two digitals which should double dip and drop you down to 198 for two but then it gets even better y'all because on abata again the free cashback app i have an offer giving back 50 cents on like certain ones so like if i got two of the cinnamon toast crunch i would get back a dollar 50 cents for each box making them making two of them 98 cents or what like 49 cents each and then the second promotion which i'm excited about because my kids love fruit loops but like select Kellogg's are three for six, so $2 a box. And I always like to check websites of like items that I'm gonna be purchasing anyway. So like I went to the Kellogg's website and y'all, we have printable coupons. So let me show you. We have a uh, one off of two paper coupons that you can use. So what'll end up happening is it'll just drop it down to three for five. But again, these are items I was gonna pay for anyway, but here's the coupon one off of two when you buy two of like the uh, kellogg cereals so you can mix and match how you prefer so i think i'm gonna get three of the kellogg's and we don't have any abata offers for that and then two of the general meals i think i'm gonna get the cinnamon toast crunch i was hoping they had the honey nut cheerio ones because i know we have an offer on abata for that as well but um yeah a great time to get stocked up on some cereal and then check your accounts because Sometimes I will get like three off of 10 snack CRTs or like they'll text it to me. So always try to maximize your savings even more, especially if you have like a threshold coupon, like spend 30, get $6 off, especially if you're gonna pay for these items anyway. All right, y'all, so this is how I plan on doing my cereal deal. Now again, you don't have to do it like this. You could just pick up the General Mills cereal. They're $1.99 each, or you could just get the Kellogg's. Remember the select ones are three for six. But I'm going to get two General Mills and then three Kellogg's. And this should total me $9.98. But then remember, for the General Mills, I have two of those one-off of two digitals. So that should take off $2. And then I have that one-off of two paper printable coupon that I got from the Kellogg's website um, that I'm going to be using for the Kellogg's. So that should take off $3 leaving me to pay $6.98 at the register. But then remember, I'm gonna submit my receipt to Abata for 50 cents for the Cocoa Puffs and 50 cents for the uh, Cinnamon Toast Crunch. So I'll be getting back a dollar from Abata, making all five cereals just $5.98, y'all. Or about a dollar or something each, which isn't bad considering this is something I was gonna pay for anyway. So again, a great time to get stocked up, but I'm actually gonna throw this into like a um, threshold coupon like spend 60, I mean, spend 30, get $6 off. So let me show you how I'm planning on doing that. All right, y'all. So for me, I'm going to throw in that Cottonelle and Viva deal that I already mentioned. And then everything should bring me to $30.96. So that'll allow me to use that six off of 30 threshold CRT that I have. So once that comes off, along with the digital coupons and the paper coupon for the cereal, 
at the register, that'll then drop me down to paying $21.96 at the register. But again, use extra bucks to lower your out of pocket. So I'm going to let you know how much it's actually going to be for me. But if you didn't have extra bucks, you would pay the $21.96 out of pocket. But then remember, you would get back the $5 extra buck for the Viva and Cottonelle deal. And then we would get back the dollar in cash from Abata for the General Mill cereal. So 50 cents for each box. That'll then make everything just $15.96 or $2.28 each. But for me, I'm going to use that $10 extra buck from the spend $30 deal. So then my total would be $21.96. But then after that $10 extra buck comes off, I would pay $11.96 at the register. And then again, I would get back the dollar um, from Abada in cash, making my cash out of pocket just $10.96. Or if you want to factor in the $5 extra buck I'm getting from the Cottonelle deal, then that'll drop this down to just $5.96. But I'm trying to focus more so on my actual cash out of pocket. So my cash out of pocket will be $10.96 for all of these items or just $1.56 each. But again, remember, I'm going to be reselling the paper products. So my out of pocket actually is not going to be that much, but just to kind of show you different ways you can look at it. And again, remember I, I was going to pay for the cereal anyway. So the fact that I can get things I need, and then again, use those extra bucks to lower your out of pocket an amazing time to get stocked up. So another way you could do the deal though, if you didn't want the cereal, I'm not going to do it though, but I'll just show you. You could do the v, um, the Neutrogena deal. So let me show you how it would look if maybe you wanted to do the Viva with the Neutrogena and maybe you didn't need the cereal. So you could do your deal like this. I thought about doing it like this, but then I thought about the fact that I need cereal more and I have so many of those Neutrogena uh, bars. But you could do your deal like this, factoring in the Neutrogena and the Viva and the Cottonelle. Then this will bring you to $29.95. And then again, if you're still honest, the 98% rule, which most stores do, uh, you'll still be able to use that six off of 30 threshold CRT if you have it. Now, again, those vary account by account. So check your email. Sometimes they'll email them to you. But that'll drop you down to $23.95. And then you would pay that at the register. But then you would get back the $5 extra buck for the Viva and Cottonelle deal. And then you'll get back $7 for the Neutrogena deal. Then making this $11.95 or $2.39 each. Now, remember, this is like worst case scenario because it could be even cheaper if you're using extra bucks. But I did just want to show you another way that you could do your deal. Or again, you might want to factor in like the Crest or the Oral-B deals where you spend like 10, get back five. Um, because again, we have digitals for those. So several ways you can kind of switch your deal around based off of your needs. And if you don't know already, like CVS Christmas holiday clearance hit 75% off. Nothing that I really was too thrilled about, but I still just wanted to mention it in case you're one that needs some items or wants to get like stocked up for next year. And then also check the electronics. These have been on clearance for quite some time, but like I always say, never trust the price tag. I always do like a price check because some of those that are like 30% off could be even more. Um, like they could be 50% off and 75% off. So tons of electronics on clearance. All right, y'all, went ahead and checked out doing the last transaction where I did the cereal with the paper products. Let me show y'all the receipt. So there's all the cereal ringing up three for six for the Kellogg's, the General Mills ringing up for $1.99. There's the cotton deal in the Vivo at $10.49 each. My one off of two paper coupon for the Kellogg's scan successfully. The one off of two digitals for the General Mills did double dip. The six off of 30 CRT came off, and then I used ten dollars and ten cents in extra bucks, leaving me to pay eleven eighty six before tax. And I did get back the five dollars for doing the um, Cottonelle Viva deal, and I submitted my receipt to Abada and got back the dollar in cash. So this ended up costing me fifteen ninety six if you don't have any extra bucks. And then after you get back the course dollar back from Abada, making this two twenty eight for like each of the um, items with the cereal and the paper products. But for me, um, after the dollar cash back and after my extra bucks, it cost me ten eighty six or one fifty five each. But for everything, so the Avino and with everything combined. So for me, everything combined here, including my tax, but of course tax varies state by state. So it could of course be much cheaper. But if I'm thinking about my actual cash cost, everything right here, after the gift card I used from Fish Rewards, so between both transactions, everything cost me 14 
26. But then remember, I got back a dollar for the cereal from Abada in cash. And then I got back $6 in cash for the Avino also from Abada. So I got back $7 from Abada. Then dropping this down to $7.26 for my out of pocket. And then remember, I'm going to be getting back that $10 Visa gift card, which I'm going to treat as cash. Um, drop making this not only for y'all, but a $2.74 money maker. Um, and then remember, I did get back $5 extra bucks for the paper deal and then $10 for the Vina. So I have $15 to work with. So definitely not bad. Y'all comment below how y'all like to look at your scenarios. I think this time around, now that I'm like kind of getting back into couponing more at CVS, I think I'm just going to more so focus on like my actual cash that I spent out of pocket, but I'll still try to show you like different ways, especially if you're using extra bucks, but you definitely can't beat that. Y'all got paper products, personal care and food and made money taking all these items out the store. So definitely comment below if you're doing any CVS couponing. I would definitely say this is a great week to get stocked up, whether it's on personal care, household, or food items. But don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see y'all next time. Bye-bye.